What we're looking at here is uh, dust devil, or they, they call it a whirlwind, but uh, you know, if you're out in West Texas, where I'm from, we, we see these a lot. Yes, dust sir. devils is what I call them. Uh, very cool shot, uh, as uh, that was near the airport. Here's how these work. So what happens is the sun heats the surface, uh, warm air rises, of course, and the area of low pressure forms at the surface. Then uh, you get some circulation. So air flows towards the middle of that low pressure, flows around the low pressure, and it starts to speed up. So you get that spinning motion, and then you get continued heating. So that helps the lift, and circulation picks up dirt and debris, and that's when you start to see it. So that's why you get uh, dust devils or these whirlwinds, as they called it. And again, you see these a lot out in West Texas, but you certainly can see them here around San Antonio. Uh, with the heating of the day. So anyway, uh, there you go. Great picture sent in on our KSAC Connect. We do appreciate it. 10 a.m., 78 degrees. By noontime, 86, 91 at 2 o'clock. And by 4 p.m., we're at 94 with sunny skies. It's going to be another quiet but hot day. Temperatures above average during the afternoon. Uh, uh, yes, do we have a question over here? Yes. Are dust devils dangerous? Oh, the meteorologist Sarah Spivey asking. <laughs> Are dust devils dangerous? Uh, no, but they're, I've actually stood right in the middle of one. And uh, it's, you know, blows you around a little bit, but it's not yeah. dangerous.